In other news, it seems like as if Jay Hood is going at Lloyd Banks. Now, I'm interested in this personally because I like both artists. And what's interesting about it is the simple fact that they both have projects coming out next month. So, he sent a tweet out to Lloyd Banks saying, At Lloyd Banks, I thought you had retired, geez. Don't 50 Cent got you jammed up in one of those young buck type contracts? And it took off from there. And Jay Hood said himself, like, this is a competitive sport. I don't have nothing but love for Lloyd Banks. But you know how these mark-ass fans, they take things so little. And they've been going at Jay Hood say, oh, man, you a nobody. You washed up. You clout chasing. This is what's the problem, man. This is what the problem's with a lot of hip-hop today, man, is that I don't care how many fans, I mean, how many followers this guy got. Jay Hood been putting out consistent good music for the past several years, man. The project with Yuck Mouth was dope. The Pesci joint was dope. He dropping another one, another Pesci joint. He been putting in a lot of work. Whereas I think what he's doing with Lloyd Banks, he see it as a great opportunity to not only, you know, cause a little of attention. That's what everybody else does. But also, kick that competitive drive up for Lloyd Banks. Because Lloyd be too laid back. That's good promo for him because Lloyd Banks doesn't even really do promo. So I don't know if them two really kicked back on some WWE stuff and thought of a marketing scheme for both projects to come out. But either way, I'm in tune with it. I'm in tune with it, man. And let me ask you this. Everybody say, oh, man, nobody checking for this. Who should we be checking for? Who should we be listening to in 2021? I hate when people say that, like, ain't nobody checking for this, ain't nobody checking for that. Who should the people be listening to? Answer that question. That's what I want to know. But Lloyd Banks is dropping his project, and Joe and um Jay Hood is dropping his project on the same day. So I'm interested to see how they, they're going to sound. Because the last passion joint was dope. You know, Lloyd Banks, he he's no slouch either. So we shall see. Let me know what you guys think. Subscribe. Hit the like button. I'm about to get off and get this interview done with Scam Man for the Killer Clan Cage tonight. So tune into that. Holla.